For the future, we focus on the following things. One is grow the customer base and the level of consumer engagement around e-commerce on the platform. There are various ways to do that. One straightforward way is to continue improving the purchase experience and acquiring new and more customers. We will leverage our logistics network and all the work that we continue to do there to open up new geographic areas and therefore new markets. Two is to expand uh, the merchant base. It's to start filling in the gaps. We want a fully comprehensive catalog of goods, the different kinds of price ranges. We want to be able to move upstream, but also fill in categories that are largely missing right now, like CPG, like grocery products. We want our consumers to feel like they can get anything from Wish, capture a larger share of wallet and continue increasing the level of engagement that we have for each individual customer around everything that we actually sell. We're really proud of the platform that we've built with the level of consumer engagement we've had with the participation from the merchant side. And we'll be looking to actually leverage everything that we've built, tools and services on top of that, in order to take our business to the next level. We built a differentiated company focused on an underserved consumer base and provided merchants with an engaged global consumer base for their products. The IPO is a hugely important milestone for the team and for myself. But at the end of the day, it's just a milestone. What's important is what comes next. As a public company, we will leverage our decade of experience, our data advantage, and our strong partnerships to drive ambitious growth and power new initiatives. And we invite you to join us in changing the face of retail.